Look at them drowns. <laughs> he's spawning in front of my eyes. Not really. Ah, uh, yeah, now he's on to us. Yeah. Oh, he has a trident. Ooh. Oh, watch out, watch out. <laughs> no worries. I'm gonna go down here, have a look. Is he dead? Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, no. Man, no, his no aim is complete. Oh, okay, okay. Watch Sorry, out. dude. <laughs> watch out, watch out. Is he, is he coming? Oh, he's down here. <laughs> Ooh. How'd he get here? What the um, heck? He stepped on the carpet and walked on the what? How did he do that? That's. He walked along here, oh. stepped up. Oh, those! I don't think they were there before because we've been doing some yeah. modifications. Yeah, yeah we've been doing a lot of testing, guys. So welcome <laughs> back to Skyblock here. <laughs> yeah. Where really it shows that 1.14 in Mob AI is still definitely not where it needs to be, man. Mm -hmm, Look mm -hmm. at this guy. Look at him. He's yeah. just chilling there. Step in the water, see if he comes for you. Yeah. So we we we. we uh... We've, we've seen yeah, the comments. There he goes. Yeah, we've seen the comments about standing in water. So we put some water down here, and yeah, they do they do come over to you. But there are some uh, some shenanigans <laughs> to worry about. Let's open this yeah. up. Yeah, I mean, you know, I used this mechanic on Hermitcraft before, but as I said, a lot of lot of it changed with their pathfinding, and yeah, it's not um, the only way we can use this farm. Pretty much to sum it up, our findings is in during the night time. They will spawn in, but they will always try to track towards the um, surface. They are not interested in anything. They are not interested in players. They're not going for us. We can literally walk below them, but they will not never leave their water. Only during daytime, they will be willing to leave the water. But then they will only track a player if they actually see him. If, oh, did you fall in the hole? Yeah, how do I? I want to swim. Can I not swim out of here? I don't know if no. I do that. Oh yeah, that's it. Okay. Done it. All right. Done it, done it. So, yeah, only, only you know, during daytime when they spawn, their behavior is a bit different. They would then just sink to the ground and land on there, on our platform. And then if we are in water, they would think, oh, cool, there's a dude in water. I want to go get him. But they need a line of sight for that. And, you know, it takes them a while to track. And we're pretty far away here. So, yeah, this is... This is quite a challenge now to make a proper drowned farm, let's say, with simple means. Um, so, yeah, it's quite interesting. How many times do you want to jump? Oh, no. <laughs> I was trying to be cool and just jump over, but uh, I failed. <laughs> I failed at being cool, <laughs> as my kids remind right. me all the time. <laughs> so, yeah, what we're doing at the moment is we're setting up a roof, um, you know, up here, chopping some wood. <clears throat> it's almost done, like half of it or so, I would say. Or, yeah, a good third. And yeah, we want to make everything dark below, and um, yeah, be able to run the farm during daytime. Yeah, we need to do, we need then, to chop up a bit yeah. more wood. I mean, I've done I've done a bit. I've gone through quite a few axes, uh, but we might need a bit more wood. But yeah, it's uh, the grind is still real, <laughs> for sure. Yeah, but it, it's it's going it's getting there. But only our only option to run this thing is if we run it through uh, during daytime. Mm -hmm. And we have to sleep through the nights. At least the AI is then, you know, somewhat usable. Other than that, if you want to have a more efficient design for that, you would have to really, really think some time into it and uh, do pistons and other mechanics. Maybe have turtle eggs at strategic locations mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. so on. And, you know, if, when we get the turtle eggs, we can do some some more testing. Yep. But yeah. um, the AI and pathfinding is still weird. Yeah. I will yeah, look but... into it in 14.4 mm -hmm. on the Hermitcraft. I will look onto that. And you know, and, and see if if the behavior there is similar because we have a similar farm there, and if that is also broken, it's for sure that something is really fishy at the moment. So fishy, oh. like it? I like it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah boy. <laughs> the, other, the other thing we can try out as well, if we get a chance, is uh, well, once we get there, is to get some villagers because they also track villagers. I'm not sure if that's going to be a different range to players. It might be mm -hmm. another experiment yeah. we can do for sure. But uh, yeah, it's a bit janky. Yeah, for sure. But um, on the bright side, even with this, you know, janky setup, you know, by running back and forth and um, having them spawn in the night and then during daytime fall down and just, as you saw last time, they will have no AI pretty much and just stand there. We could kill a few and we got two gold ingots at the moment. In oh, total. I got one. I got another one. I must have got one from... What? I got a gold ingot. Nice. I didn't even realize I had it. <laughs> yeah, oh, wow. here's the one, I, the additional one I got. How awesome! So that's in total three. Oh, right three, now. yeah, because there's one back at base. Oh, brilliant! Yeah, we didn't <laughs> kill too many, dude. No. I looked it up. The drop rates also were marked out at five percent. Uh huh. But we did. I don't know. We didn't kill barely like 30, 40 of them, mm -hmm, and we got yeah. three ingots already. 
pretty so good. Either the, the rates are different and they're eleven percent as they are on bedrock and they changed something with it. Uh, yeah. And these are these small little things you recognize, you know, when you play the mm. game for a while, all of a sudden it feels like that is they That's, dropped more gold. Yeah. Is there something? Yeah, so are, are we being lucky or is this, are this how it's going to be? Because, yeah, I mean, if we get some gold apples, then we're well on the way to villagers. Um, what I'd like to do this episode, if we can, I'm not sure if we'll be able to, but if we can get a couple of zombie villagers over to the witches and kind of yeah. in, in preparation for the conversion, uh, that would yeah, be really cool. Yeah, definitely get that done. I mean, this roof won't, won't take too long for us now. But yeah, you know, that's a, a funny thing. I often see in the comments, quickly want to address that. Like people often ask, how do you guys find this stuff? <laughs> you know, <laughs> and that's exactly one of these situations where you, when you play the game for a while, you recognize small little things like, why did we get so much gold, gold out of that already? Is there something? And then you would do tests or look into the code or similar. Mm -hmm. You know, these are these little hints, and then you, you know, track it down, pretty much. So yeah, with that said, now we go from highly philosophical Minecraft development back to <laughs> the very basics, which is building a, a roof yeah. out of slabs. Placing blocks. One How more block. <laughs> yeah, about half done, I would say. Yeah, almost there, actually. Yeah. Yep. Okay, let's go. So we will see. During daytime, we'll check the spawn rates now, and hopefully... We get some decent flow of mobs. All right, look at that. It's working. We got them in the. We got them in the chamber. Oh, got gold. Got another one. Dude. Yes. <laughs> I also Brilliant. got one more. There's something clearly. Those gold drop rates are higher. Yeah, this definitely. This can be. It's yeah, yeah. more than five percent. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So we also got a few guys with tridents already. There's this one guy behind. Let me see if I can ding him and get his attention. Oh, baby. No. <laughs> Yeah, but it should be baby safe too. Yeah, yeah. So the ones that land a bit in the back are not really tracking us. That could be helped. If you get some turtle egg, you know, get them to a certain point with the turtle eggs and get their attention with the turtle eggs in combination with us as a bait. It should be fairly good. So now the thing is those that haven't tracked us and are just chilling there, like if we close this now, right, we should be able to run up to them and they will not do anything to us. Will they? Yeah, they ignore us. Yeah. Oh, God. No okay. longer. This guy clearly pulled his through. Oh, oh run, run, run. <laughs> He's throwing tridents. Yeah, that's, that's the only thing with this. We've got to be careful with the trident guys because they, they can get us. But luckily for us, they're quite bad shots. Uh, we've, had a few yeah, that, we've had a few that have spawned and just throw tridents and they don't often hit. It's very rare they actually hit us. So that's, uh, they're killing each other instead of anything. That's no good. We want, we want to kill him. We want the gold. Oh, the other guy. Oh, the trident guy is onto me. He's coming, man. Okay. Oh, Ooh, he got you. I heard it. I need to stand in water. He should uh -huh. keep on pathfinding. Yeah. Yep, there yeah, he is. Him. Trident guy. Yeah, got him. Nice. No trident? No, no, no trident yet. Uh, no, not yet. Okay. Yeah, but if you combo it like that, I mean, look at that. We get quite a bunch of them back there. Yeah. The other, the, the, the other thing I'd like to get, obviously, the gold is the important thing, but it'd be really good if we can get a really good um, fishing rod with a, maybe okay. a good enchantment on it. That will really help. Yeah. That would be great. That would be great. Yeah, I mean, for the ones that land in the front, we get some decent tracking with them right away. We also have a, a roof up there, by the way, now fully completed in case you haven't guessed it, mm -hmm. and a cover here over the walkways. So they are safe from sunburn there too. All right. So the ones in the front, we get pretty well already. Okay, so we need some means to get the ones that are a bit further away come to track us. Hmm. Yeah, how are we going to do that? Because if we go out there, we, we are in danger, especially with the Trident guys that can knock, hit us, knock mm. us off. So we need mm. to be careful. We need to be smart about this. So yeah, we'll, mm. we'll, we'll have a think about it, see what we can, see what we can come up with. Yeah, Turtle Eggs definitely will help with them, to, you know, to get them on mm -hmm. the right path. That's yep. for sure. Yep. And then we have to just see, but yeah. Okay, now, what is it? Oh, it, that was actually a nighttime session just now, I just realized. Ah. Dude. But are they, are, yeah. they st are they still falling down or are they going up? I can't see. Oh, no, no, the sun is, no, now the moon is coming up. Okay, now they stop, should stop falling down. I was just getting confused. Yeah, of course, it was daytime, right? Okay. Yeah, moon is coming up. I was saying, oh, <laughs> nice sunrise there. All right. Yeah, yeah, nighttime behavior now. Yeah, so they should, they should yeah, swim up. Yeah, he's floating now. Yeah. See, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so at night time, it's no good. Yeah. Night time, we can right. just... Night time, yeah. no good. 
Okay, that is clear. Right, okay, so the sleep to the night. Thank God we have some more beds there, and then their behavior should change right away, right? Mm -hmm. Let's see. Let me scoot around. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, let's <sighs> test it out. Yeah, this is interesting, though, you know. Obviously, that slowed our progress down a bit because we ran into some roadblocks here with that uh, weird behavior. But yeah, as you can see, during daytime, this guy quickly caught onto us, and we got getting good spawns in there. So yeah, we'll farm for a little while. See maybe if we can think of a smart solution. Maybe you can use some water streams to flush the back ones forward. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah. Absolutely. Although they ignore water quite well, but maybe, oh, you know, yeah. just to bring them a bit closer. Yeah, we can try. We can try. Yeah, why not? Yeah. So Doc, my friend, we have, uh, we've got some success. So in my inventory, I've got six gold ingots. So we've been doing some grinding. We've got to, we've got a bit of a method working out now, I think. It's not ideal by any means, but uh, it's probably good enough. Um, yeah, it's a, a range question, right? We clearly determined that now. I went up, out there with a bucket of water, placed it a little bit closer. And it's just the ones that you see there in the back. They're just slightly out of range. So yeah, we, we installed another little thing up there. What do we get up there, bro? <laughs> yeah, so I'm standing up here. So I'm standing up in water uh, just above you. Uh, so that gives a bit more of a line of sight. I think that seemed to have uh, helped out. And I'm standing in water, so they get attracted to us. But yeah, the ones at the back are a bit too far away. But uh, yeah, when it's when it's daytime and they're standing on the platform, if they're in range, then they come over to us. And we've had uh, quite a few bits, uh, quite a few times where we've had quite a few come over to us and uh, yeah, did the choppy choppy and yeah, we get some gold. So yeah, like I said, it's not it's not ideal. It's not perfect by any means, but this is going to be just enough, I think, to get us the gold we need uh, for those two golden apples. Yeah, and it's clearly confirmed by now. We reached how many? Like nine gold already, or so. Yeah, so right. I've got I've got six on me, and we've got three back at base, so we've got nine in total so far. So yeah, yeah. so clearly the gold spawn rates cannot be five percent mm -hmm. in comparison to what we went through with the iron. Like this is a completely different ball game. We didn't like kill nearly as many. Yeah, 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 um, for sure. For sure not. Yeah, that yeah. is they're, they're, they're definitely different rates because we have chopped up uh, probably a million, <laughs> million zombies, and uh, yeah. yeah, to get that iron. But yeah, this is definitely can different. Can you break the line of sight so we can see them sinking down? Yeah. So if I door. yeah, so if I close the trap door, breaks the line of sight, and hopefully they will be sinking down. Yep, they all drop down, and now they're kind of in reach. You see, that is our combo wombo. Uh, yeah. Like, so. They spot uh, Logic up in there, try to swim towards him in the water, mm -hmm. right? Then he breaks the line of sight, then they drop down, and then they're close enough for sure to see me, mm -hmm. you know, and then I get him. Yep. This way we can get a pretty decent stream, and if you get lucky and have a few drop in the front, they will come for us anyways. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. This is the best we can do, I think. I think uh, as well, even if we would be in a more advanced world, we would have to put some, some brain power into this farm and probably install a slime sweeper or something mm -hmm. to make sure the ones that drop a bit further back, you know, or you would have to go for an arrangement that is kind of circular, mm -hmm. right? With the player in the middle. In the middle, yeah, yeah. I think that would work. Yeah. Or the, the player below. Mm -hmm. um, something like that, that would maybe be ideal. Yeah. So this classic setup we used here is definitely not ideal for a proper drown farm. So that's definitely some potential, man. We got to put our uh, thinking caps on and bring a proper tutorial for yeah, I think, uh, for yeah. adjusted one, man. Yeah, but there's there's definitely a gap in the market for that. Uh, we haven't oh. got uh, we haven't got a, a trident yet or a fishing rod, but I did get a no. shell. But uh, yeah, that is super rare. But as I said, yeah, the gold is off. I, I'm gonna ask Sky to look into the code a bit and see uh, if he can confirm these drop rates. Mm -hmm. Either we had to, we should go to Las Vegas right now and play lottery <laughs> and everything. But yeah, I don't think so. Something's off. That's for mm -hmm. sure. Yeah, yeah, I agree, definitely. Dude, there's two Trident guys on there. Wait, where are you going? What are you doing? <laughs> are you crazy? <laughs> oh I'm not doing anything. Man. <laughs> oh. Look, they're just they want to give me that Trident. <laughs> I hope you know what you're doing. Oh my okay. god! Okay. He's after you. It's after you. Run, run. <laughs> okay, so if you attack the Trident guys, can you close the hedge so I can? Oh, okay, can I? Oh god! Ooh. You're right. Yep. Okay, he's coming. Okay, so if you attack the Trident guys, they really want to mess with you. <laughs> Dude, trident drop. You're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's trying to come. Come now, though. Yeah. yeah, he's on his way. Right, he's in the hole. Almost. There's another one dropping. Okay. Right, yeah, I'm gonna chop him up. Okay, we got a trident streak now. You gotta okay. break the line of sight. Yeah, they're coming down. Okay, okay. Nothing yet. Another trident guy on the way for sure. Yeah, he's coming. Oh, and there's a few out there, man. Oh, I want a trident. Not that it is great, but it would be finally something, you know, of value, a decent yeah. weapon of some sort. Yeah, well, well, don't forget, we do need one because we want to get uh, we want to get channeling so we can get a charged creeper mm -hmm. at some point. So we do need it. Yeah. 
Yeah. Trident man and fishing rod boy. Come on. <laughs> is, that, is that a new superhero double act? <laughs> you just invented. <laughs> this guy needs to give us his trident now. Come on, dude. We should we should uh, we should contact Marvel about those. See if we can yeah. get a, a deal. <laughs> okay, we're we getting it? everything, man. We're getting we're getting Nautilus shells, crappy fishy rods. Yeah, I've lots got lots of gold. Yeah, I've got gold four. Trident. Yeah, four Nautilus shells still on seven gold. So yeah. we're on, we're making progress, but it's just a lot of grind. Another trident guy. Let's see what happens with this one. Yes, I got it. I got a trident. No, <laughs> for did. real? Yes, I got it. <laughs> oh, yes. God, we caught it on camera. I can't yeah, I believe it. it. I got it. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, Jeez. thank God. Thank the Minecraft really? gods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. Show me. I want to hold it. You want to you wanna, you wanna taste it? There we go. Yes. Taste the goodness. Why, dude? <laughs> again. What a... <laughs> dude, dude, don't worry. Does it have enchants? No, think, it's clean. No, it's okay, clean. cool, cool. Okay, that's all right. We need but, a channeling one, so that's great. Oh, we got to try it in. Right, that's useful. That is really useful. Right, keep hold of that. that so we good. worked out a system, guys. You know, mm -hmm. real good system now. So here we got the place up here, right? We attract them. We break the line of sight regularly and so on. And by having this double whammy, we, we are really making progress. Mm -hmm. um, how much gold do you have at so the moment? I've got nine on me plus three back at yeah. base. That's 12. So we need four more. So we're, yeah. we're, we're getting there. We're definitely getting there. Yeah, we're really close. We got to try it though now. That is a price possession. We need to keep it. Mm -hmm. Although, I mean, it didn't take us, how long are we grinding it out, you know? Maybe tops an hour, I would mm -hmm. I would say. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 And we got like all the gold and um, yeah, one trident already. No good fishing rod or anything like that, sadly. No, no I've got, no, no, no just, um, just, just, some, yeah. just some rubbish beat up ones, but uh, yeah. There's another Trident guy coming, and he's holding a Nautilus shell at the same time. You okay, see that? let's see if we can be lucky on, again. Man. Let's see it. Can we be lucky yeah. again? We're having quite a lucky day today, I feel like. I feel like... In a row. Oh, ow, hit me. Ooh. It's all right. Come on. Let's Come go. On, man. Come on. Drop it. He dropped something. I don't let me get rid of this other guy. And one more hit. I think it was the shell. Oh, so you got yeah, something. Yeah, just a shell. Yeah, I've got five, five uh -huh. shells now. Yeah, just a shell. But... Oh, okay. All good, all good. But the shells are coming along too. Mm -hmm. So yeah, um, we'll be grinding away. We definitely, we made a decision. Okay, we're going to grind out the gold today. Mm -hmm. So that is knocked out for now. And yeah, maybe we can get a second trident and maybe a good fishing rod. That would be really nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. But yeah. Um, so that's the plan. Grind out the gold. And then um, we can think about witches, villagers, and smart ways to use them together. Oh. That was it. Got it. Got the last one. Nice. Yes. <laughs> Brilliant. Let's chop these ones up as well. That was great. Oh, thank God. Thank goodness. Thank the Minecraft gods. Okay. That's all of it. <laughs> yes. We did it. We got oh. all the gold. Oh, man. That was a grind. <laughs> that and, was a grind. <laughs> and? Oh, oh, and I got one of these. Gee, Check it out. Double tried it. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> oh, dude, now we're going to do something that's going to be so satisfying. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Split up our gold right yep. down the middle. We have 16 exactly, right? None additional. No. I yeah, think so. It. Well, hopefully I can count. <laughs> hopefully we don't get over there and I've derped and we've got the wrong amount, but I'm pretty sure we've got, we got 16, which is what we need. All right. So and let's see. That's two golden apples and that's, you know, 50% of the way there to get villagers. Mm -hmm. Yep. Dude, that is so. This is huge. We're close. We're really don't close. Realize, guys, this is huge. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, because, man, and the, the other thing you probably don't realize is how long it takes us to do anything in this world. <laughs> just standing over there grinding yeah. at those, those, uh, those drums. the heat wave. It's the heat wave time, oh, man. man. Oh, man. <laughs> like, both of us have like 40 degrees in their rooms and we have, we have fans running all the time. And then in between recording, we need to cut them off. And it's terrible. <laughs> Feel like in the sauna. Okay, come on, let's let's do something to brighten. Okay, the I've got. Okay, I've got all the goods. I've got the goods come out here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let me right. Let me split. Let me split these in half. So there we go. There's your half, and I've got my half, and there's your apple. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. Ha, okay, get ha, my. Can I get my apple ha, over here? What? what you mean what's that my additional ingot? Well, I don't have a spare one. This come the, on. I've got. No, no, you didn't miscount. 
There you go. <laughs> oh, God. Sorry, I was, I was, I was, no <laughs> I was, I was hoping you might, you might fall for that. <laughs> no, not biting. Okay, here we go. Mm. Oh, yes. Check it out. Yes. Mm, I'm, I'm going to eat it. No, no, don't, don't, don't. <laughs> I'm not going back there. I'm not going back over there and doing that again. <laughs> no okay, way. Let's put them away. That is by mm -hmm. far our most prized possession. Let's put mm -hmm. them into the kind of, you know, treasure chest, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Look at them two beautiful buns, man. Mm. Oh, I'm going to try it with them. Oh, brilliant. So good. I, so I think good. I'm going to put my trident in there too. Yeah, just to be sure, <laughs> man. It was like... Okay. A, right, good. So that is a done deal, yo. So mm -hmm. technically now to proceed, honestly, we need to do some more testing. We need to figure out a safe way to transform, um, you know, the villagers or zombie villagers with the help of a witch. Mm -hmm. I yep. don't think it makes much sense to, you know, just try to wing it. We will die. Yep, yep. We need 100%. we need to plan. We need to think about this. We we'll probably go into a creative test world, do some tests, do get get some do, do some old fashioned uh, you know Minecraft science. You know, with well, you know, you you got your lab coat on, so we need to yeah. do some of that. You know, yeah, exactly. that'd be good. But yeah, I would say we can wrap it up for this one. This was a huge success. Two mm -hmm. tridents, two golden apples. I don't think we need to come back to this farm anytime soon mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. um, and the next time we run it, we already thought about it uh, about some really good improvements we could make. Yep. to make it a really good one. But honestly. If we don't lose the tridents, we have no real good reason to try to farm more drowns, right? No, because we... You, no. Like, sure, to get some gold, maybe, if you want to make some tracks, something, but... No, you know, I think of that. no. If if you want gold, if you want proper gold, we need to go to the Nether and do it with pigmen. That's the that yeah. that is the way forward. Yeah, with a with a, a turtle egg, that kind of thing. That's the kind of yeah. stuff we want. But yeah, now we've got a trident, so we can get channeling. We can get a we can use the lightning for various bits and pieces. That would be good. Hey, yeah. that's that's how we could get a witch. We could, Success, we could get a, we could we can trap a a villager yeah lightning turn it into a witch oh yeah, yes first we need the witch you know that's the that's the egg and the chicken thing mm -hmm. there. you know yeah. because if we don't you know what i mean i know i know i'm All getting right. excited i'm getting excited <laughs> about this thing man i want to, I want to do this stuff yeah <laughs> yeah next episode we're gonna get the witch man i think next episode we're ready to try it yeah we have everything we need in place Witch needs to hit the the villager Mm -hmm. You know, we feed him the apple, get him the heck out of there. Yeah. Safe, store him. And those are then, you know, like literally we need to build them double, triple safe, have them somewhere cushioned in into, I don't know what, can't lose them. Yeah, yeah we need to <laughs> be careful. We need to, yeah, we need to yeah. not take any risks because that is going to be dangerous. That is oh, going to yeah. be high risk, but uh, I think we can do it. Oh, dude, I need to chill out now. It's too hot. Yeah, it's me too. too. It's really hot. In fact, I think I might need to take my, my top off again. Oh my gosh. Go again. <laughs> All right, guys. So, see you next time. Here from the hot top. It's really hot, man. Oh my God. See you. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. See you later. Bye. bye.